Hey guys, so, sorry about the background noise, but today I'm going to be showing you my second clay charm update. So, yeah, uh, before this gets too long, I'm just going to start. So, first I have a couple of Oreos. I made a lot, actually, <laughs> because I made a mold of an Oreo, a mini Oreo, and I just couldn't stop making them. So I made seven, and they're all different. Some have different colored insides and some are weird outsides, but yeah, so I made a bunch of those. And then I made three Baymaxes, and these were inspired by Creative Sculpey. So I have these three. I like this guy the best. And then there's this one, and this one, oh, sorry, this one. Then I have these cookies inspired by Funky Pink Gal. So this one is actually a magnet. And then this one is a charm. And they both have little faces and they kind of blend in with the M&M candies. Okay, and then I have this little paint palette thing. So yeah. Kind of hard to see with the lighting. Sorry. It's bad lighting. But anyway, so looks like that. Then I have two jellyfish, and these were inspired by jellyfish charms. And I don't like this one as much as I like the this one, the blue one. So yeah, <laughs> those just look like that. And then I have a couple cupcakes, um, four actually. So I have two of these kind, this one and this one. And then I have this blue one. And this purple one with microbead sprinkles. So, yeah. I have cupcakes. And then I have a bunch of pizza charms. So, I have seven. Or, well, I had eight, but then I put one on a keychain. So, I'll show you that keychain. So, yeah. Here are the seven. And they have cheese, onions, green peppers, and pepperoni on them. I think they're pretty cute. Okay, now we have some pick a flip charms. Two puddings, um, popcorn, and a cupcake. And these are really bad, I'm sorry. They just are. Puddings. I don't like this pink pudding. But anyways, so I have those. And then I have these dumpling charms, and I'm sorry, I cannot remember who they're inspired by. But they have a bunch of air bubbles in them, if you look closely. I don't like it. Mm, focus, sorry. It's probably really annoying. Um, okay, so, yeah, I don't really like that. But it looks okay glazed, I think. That one glazed and that one isn't. And then I have this just chocolate chip cookie, and it's kind of bad, but, you know, whatever. And then I have this cookie, star cookie charm, and the back is messed up because the eye pin went through there, but then I couldn't, I forgot to fix it. Yeah. <laughs> Not over there. Then I have this little cat taco, or I mean taco cat, inspired by Blue Irish Bunnies. And hers is a lot better than mine, but you know. So it's just got different fillings and stuff. I'm sorry about the lighting. It says different fillings and stuff. And then there's a cat and a cat. Um, now I have this little um, pipe. Uh, oh, sorry. This frosting charm, and I think it's moderately cute, it's just piping bag, it had little frosting, but it broke off, so, it's too fragile to sell anyway, so now it, I can sell it, I guess, probably not, <laughs> so now I have these little planet charms, and I'm sorry, I cannot remember who these were inspired by, so I have three Earths and two Marses, this over here, and so now I have this little bee charm, and this is inspired by XX Rufus in her remake tag. And the face is lopsided, but, you know, whatever. 
I really don't notice things before I bake them. That it's that's not a good habit. Anyway, so then I have this little toast with butter on it. Yep. This little Mike Wazowski, and I need to make a silly too, but this is Mike. Oops. And he doesn't stand up. It just stinks, but whatever. So he uses the horns and stuff, and a huge dog, which I don't like how big the eye is. And then I have these, this hammer and um, pencil for my breakfast journal to put on the outside. So yeah, the hammer's really bad. I'm not good at making tools. And then I have these two little tarts, um, jars, and oops, there we go. And this one's strawberry. And this one is blueberry. I like the blueberry one better, even though the proportions on it are really bad. Look how big that blueberry is compared to that strawberry. That's crazy, but whatever. And uh, a couple more charms before I go into miniatures and other stuff. So I have this lollipop. And there's just a toothpick for a stick. So, yeah. And... Then I have this little lemon meringue pie charm. Yeah. Um, I have this little fin charm. Fin head, I should say. This flower inspired by 202 Snowflake, I think, something like that. Um, this marshmallow looks like that. This little chocolate thing with caramel inside. Caramel, however you say it. I say caramel. Okay, so that is it for the charms. Now I have a couple of other random things. So, this is a big butterfly and it's really bad. And like you can see all the glaze marks and stuff and my fingerprints are in it. But, I was just trying to. I was experimenting with butterflies and big things. I don't know what I'm going to do with this, it's just a random big butterfly. So I'll just put this over here, the side. And then I have some earrings. These are some really bad panda earrings. They don't even look like pandas. But, yeah, so I have that one and this one, and they're not even, like, symmetrical. Like, this eye is way bigger than that eye. And the mouth is messed up, and just, I don't know, I don't like this. And then I have these two chocolate chip earrings, chocolate chip cookie earrings, and they look like that, and they're textured if you look closely. Sorry about the terrible lighting. Oh. There we go, so they're textured and stuff. And yeah, so there are those. And now moving on to, oh wait, one more thing. Or a couple more. Yeah, a couple more. So I have this little donut ring, and I'm sorry, I cannot remember who this was inspired by, but this is just so cute. You put it on your finger, and it's just like a donut ring. So cute. I love this. Now, the struggle is getting it off my finger. Oh, that wasn't a struggle. Never mind. Okay, now moving on to miniatures. Uh, this little cinnamon roll platter thing. And, yeah. There's a frosting and stuff on it. These little, this little potato, uh, card, cutting, preparing, I don't know, potato preparation board is what I'm gonna call it. So, yeah, and there's, like, little eyes on the potato, you know, potato eyes, not, like, actual eyes. Okay, sorry about that. Um, so I had this little lemon ring pie and a little slice, and I'm sorry that the plates don't match, but I couldn't recreate this color because I mixed it and I only mixed enough for one plate because I was not smart like that. So yeah, just like that. This was inspired by Akimaru Kawaii, I think. I'm sorry, I'm pronouncing that wrong probably. But anyways, so then I have these french fries and there's a little ketchup. I think that's pretty cute. Then I have these two little milkshakes and this one's chocolate and this one's strawberry. I made the strawberry one first, but then I thought it was a cute idea, so then I made a chocolate one later, like two weeks later. Um, so then I have this banana split inspired by a sugar charm shop. 
this little sushi thing platter made or er, inspired by Tony Allison. This little cookie baking cookies on a baking bin. And that is it for the miniatures. Miniatures, <laughs> sorry. And I'm going to go into American Girl Ball stuff. So I made this burger. All kinds of toppings in it. Um, this little ice cream cone thing. This little macaron thing. Macaron. I don't know how to pronounce it. This waffle with really really bad syrup yeah um a really bad cake roll I, I don't know what it just does not look like a cake roll I don't know why I made it red either I don't know. anyway <laughs> this pizza slice this which I'm sorry cannot remember who this is inspired by but it's a little ice cream and waffle cone or er, waffle bowl with a little wafer. I think it's really cute. And then I have this little uh, cupcake. Okay, so now I have one more thing and it is just a keychain. This is for my mom for Mother's Day. And it just, oops, sorry, I'm trying to get it back. It just looks like this. Oops, sorry. So there's a little pizza slice and otter. Um, a guitar, sorry my voice just got really quiet, and a heart, so yeah, I don't know if she'll like it, the odds are really terrible, but whatever. Thank you so much for watching, see you next time, bye!